put it on the alignment table, insert here. They're also 112. They're also the correct height. Coming to a shop near you soon. Rambler frames coming soon. So now I got the first sample done. 21 inch, 13.75 rear end. And throw it on the table, make sure all the angles are good. Simulation of frame built up, wheels on it, and everything. Going, got a little bit of wobble. 7425 head tube, perfect. Bottom bracket height, 1.6. So we're at 3.1 minus 1.5. So exactly 1.6. Dead on. Good to go. Now we're gonna run them. Coming to a shop near you soon. I got the Nathan Hallahan Rambler frame. We're gonna put it on the alignment table and double check it. Make sure everything's good. That way we know that the fixtures are working correctly. So the frame's locked in here. It's perfectly parallel with the table. I got that guy backwards. There we go. So the first thing we're gonna check is that the head tube is in line with the seat tube so the whole front end is straight now if it weren't straight these wouldn't slide over these blocks wouldn't slide over the, the insert here so we know the front's good we'll leave that locked in just to keep it even more secure but we've got the right spacer block in here for this style of bottom bracket so if we had a wider bottom bracket we'd have a narrower a lower spacer block if we had a narrower one, we'd have a taller one. So this keeps the center line of the frame perfectly in line with the center line of this tube, which is also interchangeable for 25-4, 27-2. Now, in the back, and if that, if that wasn't straight, that wouldn't go in. So you know that's good too. Now the whole thing's perfectly parallel. You can check that the dropouts are where they're supposed to be, the correct width got to get the right spacer block so I've got 112 millimeter ID uh, inside measurement and then I've got the the correct tool for this thickness of dropout if we had the quarter inch dropout I would use this 112 block with the wider slots and then we have blocks for 135 so this is sort of a you know mountain bike spacing that we're using on the booze cruise and then also a 110 which is what you would use on a race frame. So our block is sliding perfectly in. So we know the dropouts are a parallel to one another. They're also 112. They're also the correct height and center to the table. So the center of the bottom bracket, center of the head tube, center of the seat tube, and center of the dropouts. Everything is, is on the same plane. So that's the idea there. Uh, then we've got some other tools that we use, these tapered tools so that you know that the uh, frame is perfectly symmetrical. You can check your center lines with these indicators. You can also make contact with the seat stays or make contact with the chain stays at different points. And again, everything is measured to come off the table so the center line is, is the same as the rest of the frame. So that's a real quick overview of how we determine that the frames are perfectly straight. And this is the Nathan Hallahan Rambler, first one. Yo, what up? It's Hoder. 
I just wanted to check in and say I have a new graphic for my frame coming out. It's a new Born to Mob sticker I drew up. I tend to sketch a little bit all the time actually and just always drawing stuff and trying to come out with new stickers and cool new stuff and I don't know, just constantly drawing and I figured I'd draw a new sticker design for the for the BTM frame and this is it. I uh yeah, it's kind of more like an Aztec Aztec kind of print. I don't know. I don't know what you call it. I just come up with like a come up with a cool letter and go with it and then color it in and make it look the way I wanted it to. And it's going to come on a brown gloss brown frame, a gloss purple frame and a gloss red, I believe. And I don't know. I think I think it'll look cool on on the uh, on the bike. It's got a cool head tube sticker to go with. And yeah, S&M bikes, baby. Newborn mob. BTM colors, gloss clear MODs, trans brown MODs, mixtape John Nelson colorway, a couple new colors of bars, forks to match the new BTM XL colors. Looks like we got dark plum, some brown. bars to match the new fork colors all coming soon all right we got Rita over here stickering up the new Shane Hallahan squid frames 18 inch wheel and the new blue angel color Bye, baby.